Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a little review of the Ruffy. Uh, these are the HP20, the professional hair clippers. And of course, they're again made by Ruffy. They're a pretty neat little box they come in. They uh, sent them to us to uh, take a little review of them, see what we think. So we're going to try to uh, open them up here, take a look. Uh, hope you guys enjoy. Follow along. Uh, we're going to take a look at these clippers, see what they can do. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and open these up and uh, just see what's in the box. It starts out here. We've got a instruction manual. Tells you a little bit of everything. I've kind of read over them a little bit and just to see what these do and what they involve on it. So, but that, uh, of course, it has a instruction book. And then let's just kind of look and see what's in the box. The first thing, nicely wrapped in some... Uh, a plastic film is actual the clippers themselves these uh they're pretty they're they fit in your hand really nice they're light up in the front here is the button to turn them on so i'm gonna flip them on once real quick oh yeah it's just a nice vibration they're not too loud all right they have a a box here with all the accessories in it so let's just open those up and set the accessories out like we've got some guides got a little cleaner so set this off to the side and I'll show you what comes in the box we've got these guides are pretty neat they got two different ones but they're a different size on each end of it there is a it looks like a 12 millimeter and a six millimeter on this one and this one here has a uh, three millimeter and a nine millimeter has a little brush that you can use to uh, clean off the head comes with a little bottle of oil i think you just put like a drop of oil on the blades just to keep them lubricated and this is actually the charge cord let's uh, undo this and what it is is one end of the charge cord fits into the end of the uh, razor the other end has a standard usb that you can plug into in any usb charger to charge it up so this has you'll notice at the end of it here it's got like a little side cutouts so that it only fit in one way so you just push that into the to the charging area and lined up there you go so you push that in there solid and then over here we do have just a standard usb charger you would charge a a phone or anything else with it and you just plug it into that and you see the red light comes on and that'll continue to blink and i believe what it's going to do after it's fully charged it'll quit blinking and this light will come on and it'll stay solid it'll uh, run for about two and uh, two minutes and no i'm gonna take that back 240 minutes for quite a while uh so it'll run quite a long time so you can get quite a long use out of it all right to uh take the head off to clean it all you have to do if you just put your thumb up here at the top and push up it'll come right out of it and then this is the end of it. So you can take your little brush. Now, I haven't used it yet. So, but as you do it, you can brush that out and clean it. You can also clean the actual cutting head itself. And it comes with this little vial of oil. So after you've cleaned it, it's a good idea just to put like one drop of oil on it. There it is, just like one drop, just to keep it lubricated up. Any uh, 
hair cutting instrument like it's good to keep it lubricated up to put it back on if you look down here at the end you see like a little you know, like a little groove and you see the same thing here so if you let, let that go down into there and just take your thumb push it in place and now we got it ready to go now you can run this while it's charging if you want to leave it plugged in and run it while it's charging you can do that and so that's a handy feature you know say you have a, a big event and you got to get yourself uh, manscaped all up you can uh, hit that button it'll come on and you can uh, do your your manscaping trim your beard trim your hair whatever need to be now in order to put one of these guards on so you're you can cut at different thicknesses you see there has like a little like a little uh, tab that sticks out and you'll see right here has another tab so to put those on all you do is that easily you clip it on and so now you're ready to cut at whatever thickness that you need to cut at to take it off just give it a put you can turn it around you see we have a different cut this one if you want a longer if you want to cut trim something a little bit longer but you can see how quick and easy just give a quick little pull very engineered very nicely so we're going to go ahead and let this charge up a little bit and try to do a little cutting with uh and trim our beard here see how it works out hi guys we're going to go ahead and try to do a quick little clip job so we have our Rofi trimmer here. What we're going to do is we're going to try the mustache. I hope I don't mess it up. I'm going to put the longest guard on it, which is this one here is a number 12. So we're going to stick this on. Get it right here. There we go. Had to get it in the right direction. So we got the guard on. So this way I should be able to come down and trim it. Let's give it a try. I start with the longest guard and then we'll move down and uh, see if we can get it shorter. So let's hope we not mess up my mustache. I've never used this. See, it doesn't. This, this one, we're going to go down one. So let's, let's continue to go down. It didn't cut nothing at that point. There you go. I have to get that seated just right. Go down another one, one at a time, because you can, you can't add it back on. You can always take it off. So we'll try this one. Yeah, just barely touching it. All right, now let's go down to the smallest size. And this will probably start removing some of it. There we go. It's that simple. See with that guard on, you'll get the same length every time. So I know the smallest guard is what I want you to tr trim my mustache. Looks pretty good really, it's really even. And of course it's nice and sharp. We're gonna do our, our mustache, same thing. All right, so we've got it all trimmed up. This is actually the shortest I guess they call these a guard. Now what I'm gonna do is pop this all the way off and now I can trim around. We're gonna do some close up work.
Good trim under my nose. Looks pretty good. Now if I want to do my hair itself, I'm going to start again with this longest guard. Now we can go through here and trim our hair up a little bit. Usually I do this with my shirt off. Go do this side. Now, if we want to go down a little bit further, that's the highest one. Let's flip this off. Probably should shut it off when I do that. Now, let's trim it just a little closer here. And see, you can just take it down with that guard and go whatever thickness you want. So, we're going to do a little more trimming and we'll come back and show you the results. All right, guys, there's my final product. I maybe got a little short of it. It kind of looks nice, but that's my first haircut with the Rofi hair trimmer. This thing's pretty nice. It's easy to use. It's light. Um, I think I'm really going to like this a lot. So, hey, guys, if you enjoyed this, give us a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, comments, leave it in the section below. We'll leave a link to Amazon where you can purchase this. Uh, if you... Uh, want any more information just ask me about it i'll tell you what i know i uh, hope you enjoyed it we'll see you guys the next time i hope your hair cutting days as good as mine thanks for watching all right if you want to see how to get some of our other links when you go to our main YouTube page, up here in the, the picture area right here, you'll see it says like Facebook. You can click on that. That'll take you right over to our Facebook group. And you're welcome. You can join the Facebook group, uh, add your videos, add uh, what we meant, do some discussion there. But you can go there. If you would like to uh, support us on the Amazon, again, up in this picture, you'll see a uh, link that says Amazon. Click on that link right there. Go ahead and sign in. Make all your purchases. And uh, what will happen here, you'll give us a tip. It uh, We get a small percentage back. Costs you absolutely nothing. Uh, but it does help us out, and we appreciate that. But I'd just show you a few little links here if you want to uh, uh, go to some of the other features we have here at Lucky Dog Productions.